Hi guys, welcome back with me again in this channel. On today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can run Axel files on any Android or iPhone. So, if you want to run Windows Axel files on your Android or iPhone in 2025, yes, it's possible. And in this video, I'll show you the step by step on how you can do it with the best tools available today. So, let's just dive in. So an Excel file is a Windows executable file. Basically, it runs software on a PC by default. Android and iOS cannot open these, but there are workarounds using emulators and remote tools. So the first method that you can do is using an Excel emulator, but this is works for Android only. So you can use apps like Wine, uh, Wine 3.0, DOSBox, uh, Ino Startup Extractor or WinLater. You can just uh, download Wine or WinLater from GitHub or Android. So here, let's just find Wine for Android. This one, you can download it and then you can, uh, after that, you can install the APK on your Android, open the app, and set up the environment. Might take around one to two minutes. And you're gonna use the file manager inside to locate and open your EXE files. But you need to know that not all EXE files will run, only older or portable, portable Windows apps, uh, such as uh, Notepad, games, tools that will work. And the second method, and it works for both Android and iOS, you can use the remote desktop access. So you can install Chrome Remote Desktop or Microsoft Remote Desktop on your phone. You can go to Play Store or App Store, depend on the device that you use. Example in here, let's just use the Microsoft Remote Desktop. And here, or this one, Chrome Remote Desktop, you can install it and set up the desktop app on your PC. It must be on and run the Excel files on your PC but control it from your phone in real time. And this is the best way to use for Windows software like Adobe or games from your phone. So uh, there are also limitations so not all Excel files will work. Uh, Android or iPhone don't natively support Windows software so these methods are workarounds and it's good for lightweight or portable apps not big programs. And if you want, just want to run small tools or old games, WinLater or Wine might be, do the trick. But for full apps like Photoshop or gaming, use remote desktop. It's the most reliable way. So smash that like button if this helps. Subscribe for more tech tutorials and drop a comment if you have a specific X app you want to help running on mobile. Bye!